The 48 professional golfers who took part in the Morobe Open golf tournament in late last week were on a mission to make the most out of the tournament. With professional golfers coming in from Australia, New Zealand and the Philippines, there were also strong challenges for our PNG golfers in preparation for the Pacific Games. Tim Hart and Daniel Nisbet are professional golfers from Queensland, Australia. After studying the day two shots ahead of Tim Hart and New Zealander Sean Reardon, Nisbet struggled on the front nine. Hart turned in 400 par and Nisbet too, he found himself four shots behind with just nine holes to play. When I first played with Tim, Tim was the captain of the Queensland team, I think he might have been back in 2006, and I was playing underneath him. So I always call him Skip when I see him. Um, I think we played together 2006, maybe 2008 as well, and we played foursomes together for the Australian State Series. With a healthy crowd watching, Hart missed the green with his dead shot. And when he got it up and down for par, it was left to Nisbet for an eight-foot par for the win. Daniel Nisbet, during presentations last night at the Lake Golf Club, was happy about the hospitality and services, which were surprising for many professional golfers. Nisbet took out the grand prize money of 20,216 Australian dollars, while Tim Hart, the runner-up, got 11,671 Australian dollars. The professionals now add to the Royal Port Mosby Golf Club for this week's South Pacific Export Papua New Guinea Open. Professionals Stephen Jeffers, Paul Spago, Josh Younger, and Ryan Lins will join the strong PGA lineup in Papua New Guinea for an opportunity to win a national open. Sylvester Gawi, National MTV Sports, Lay.